In this video, we will be discussing ventricular tachycardia, torsades, and asystole. The full rhythm tutorial can be found at richacls.com. Here we have ventricular tachycardia. Ventricular tachycardia, like supraventricular tachycardia, which we discussed in a previous video, is often generated from a reentry pathway. When the reentry pathway is innervated, it initiates a pacing impulse which rapidly fires off the cardiac muscle. A ventricular rhythm faster than 100 beats per minute is termed ventricular tachycardia. It's important to note that ventricular tachycardia can be relatively stable or unstable depending on the rate and condition of the heart. It's not uncommon for a patient to walk into ER complaining of a fast heart rate only to find them in ventricular tachycardia. Patients with sick hearts and fast heart rates in ventricular tachycardia can become unconscious from lack of cardiac output and require cardioversion. Here is torsades, or more formally, torsades de point. This unique rhythm is characterized by a constantly changing rhythm amplitude. Torsades de point means twisting of the points, which would be analogous to the appearance of a twisting DNA helix or a twisted strip of paper. The changing rhythm amplitude comes from the ventricular depolarization wave constantly shifting its axis in the ventricle. Torsades can be the result of long QT syndrome or from the effect of drugs. Quinidine and pernestol are historically notable culprits. Torsades can be self-limiting in that it occurs in short episodes, which is the case in an inherited long QT syndrome. Here is a systole. A systole is usually the result of a heart that has gone from a coordinated perfusing rhythm to ventricular tachycardia, to coarse ventricular fibrillation, fine ventricular fibrillation, then, after the substrate for metabolism has been depleted, a systole. Historically, this rhythm has been aggressively treated with drugs and an external pacemaker, but the data has shown such a dismal success rate that the AHA wording is now, a systole may represent an agonal end-stage situation. Of significant note is the fact that pacing has been deleted from the asystole algorithm. For more rhythm videos, type in rich ACLS on the search bar.